In this tutorial, we're going to learn to add resources to the player in Articulate Storyline. By default, Storyline has a resource tab. So if I click on this, you can see what it looks like. In this case, I added some files. I added a PowerPoint file, a PDF, and this is a website link. And you can see the icons to indicate what those files are. Now this is the default option that you have in Storyline. Another feature we have in Storyline is that you can add a Lightbox slide to a player tab. So in this case, with this contact link. This is actually a slide created in Storyline that's added to the player as a feature. And we can see it down here in this extra scene. This is the contact page. You can see it's a slide, but we actually have it up here as a lightbox slide. What we're going to do is learn to add a resources using the default resource feature. And then we're also going to add this resource slide here as a resource up in our player tab. So let's go to our player. And this is our Player Properties window. We're going to go to the Resources tab. And you can see a list of the resources that I added. And these are the resources displayed on the resource link. Now if I want to add another resource, all I have to do is go down here to the Add button, type in a title, and we'll call this Wellness Application. And then I have the choice of adding a website link or a file. We'll select File. And you should have this Wellness application in your Assets folder. So we'll select that and hit Save. And now you can see that the Wellness application has been added to the Resources tab. And at any time that you want to delete that, you just select something. You can come down here and delete it. Or if you want to modify it, select it, and then click on this to edit. And then you can edit whatever you want to. Now let's go ahead and look at what it would take to add a Lightbox resource feature. So in this case, we're going to turn the default resource feature off. So I'm going to come over here to my Features tab. And then we've got that here displayed. We're going to turn that one off because we don't want to use the default resource feature. And we're going to add a Lightbox slide. We know we have a resource slide that we created, which is down here. And what we want to do is add that up here as a feature. So what we would do is we just come over here, select Add, type in a title. We'll call it Resources. Figure out where we want it. In this case, we want it on the top bar right, which will be right here. And then what do we want to do? We want to add a Lightbox slide. So the action is add a Lightbox slide. So we have that right here. We don't care about navigation controls. We need to select our slide. So we're going to select the slide from the course. And there's a resource slide, which we can't see because it's at the bottom of the page. But we'll select that. So I can see that my resource slide's been added. And when the user clicks. So we hit OK. And now we have a resource slide. And if I want to change the order of that, I can select that and then move it up. And then we've got that over here. Now we've got a custom resource slide. And we have this resources here. Now if you want to use both of those, something that a lot of people do is they'll make this a download. So let's say we add this. So now we've got two resources slides. What we really want to do is change the title here, right? So what we can do is come over here to the Text Labels. We're going to change the title for the Resources, which we have here, the Resources tab. And we're going to change that to Downloads. So now I can use both of those. I'm going to update the preview. So now what I have is two Lightbox slides that we created. And then this is the Downloads, which are the Resources feature that we have in Storyline. So a lot of things you can do with the resources. You can add some downloads. Uh, we can add a Lightbox slide. Let's preview this and see what the Lightbox slide looks like. So here's our published course. We got our downloads, which we can click on. We can see that here. And then the other thing is our here's our Lightbox slide resource. What's nice about the Lightbox slide is that we can leverage the freeform authoring environment that we have in Storyline. So we can build a slide, make it look any way we want to, and add it as a resource on our player. And that's basically it. Adding resources is pretty simple. Just go into your player settings and add your resources. And if you want a custom slide, create one in Storyline and then add that as a Lightbox resource. And as you can see, adding resources to your player is pretty simple. You can choose the default feature that you get in Storyline and add your resources that way. Or you can create a custom slide in Storyline and leverage the freeform authoring and then insert that as a Lightbox. Now it's just a matter of you going out there and practicing it and applying that to your next e-learning course.